Hey guys, welcome to another video of me finding another new angle to <laughs> record in my room with. This one could be a bit weirder because I'm literally right against the window. Uh, so if anybody looks in, they're just going to be like, I think this uh, this quarantine period is turning that guy insane. But anyway, let's talk about the quarantine. If it's still going like this. For all I know, the video could go up like at some other point in the future. Or, like literally tomorrow as I record this. And it won't even matter, like, but, yeah, quick note though, uh, as far as I'm aware, things are still bad, but they're not as bad, I think it's kind of, it's kind of flattened, or flattening, or going down, either or, but, but, yeah, no, maybe it's going down a bit, because, uh, the US, or, uh, not the US in general, but, uh, Florida, have been like, huh, let's reopen beaches today, it's like, would would you not wait for everything else to calm down first? Like, <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. But uh, yeah, anyway, enough about that. This is all about me, me, because the title is uh, "Quarantine Has Changed Me." Kinda, yeah. But to be fair, um, like usually around this time of year, like is when I like change a lot, especially because it's like summertime. I have like this long holiday time to actually, like you know be in my room and be with my thoughts and get sick of hearing the same thoughts so make new thoughts by doing new different things like I don't know like you probably won't notice until I record different other angles but pretty much like uh, let's just say that like I, I rearranged my shelf there's nothing down the side of here actually let me just show you so it's starting to get a bit moldy I don't know if you could see that but um, I couldn't clean it enough so I literally just was like Screw it. Let's get paint and paint the corner. And you know what? I'm kind of liking it. It's like the uh, purple thing here, you know? Where, like, instead of just being orange and green, the room's turning into multicolors, and then you just look up to the ceiling, and it's, like, white and stuff, you know? Sorry, too many camera angles for one video, I know. But, um, yeah, no, like, I just rearranged my desk there so that the computer is more, like, in life stuff. I would show you the computer, but... I'm currently doing stuff on there that I can't show. Um, but other than that, uh, what am I going to do? Well, first off, I'm actually going to say I've been exercising every day. I've gotten to a point where I'm so bored that I've started to exercise. Bruh, like, it's mad. So, I, ha I have this light plan. I've had it written since I started. It was like a Tuesday, but I don't know. I don't know why I didn't put any dates. I just have day one. So, um, I pretty much started off, uh, yeah, no, none on the back of that. Uh, the first day I started with five. The next day I already tried to push for six, and I was like, nah, too much. So, I went for five for another, like, few days, pretty much for the rest of the week. Then I went with six halfway through, uh, like, four days into having six, I put, uh, bumped up to seven. Uh, three days after that I bumped up to eight, and I've still been doing eight from here on because I've just been struggling. And at one point, uh, where was it? I did two different challenge periods. Like, the first time, I didn't push myself too hard. I just wanted to see how much I could do. I don't know why I didn't write it down. Well, actually, all I have is as many as possible. And then there was another one um, where pretty much I kind of... I screwed my core, like, the belly part, you know? And I actually had to stop doing uh, uh, pull-ups for a day. Because it was so bad. Is it pull-ups? Sit-up, sorry. I, I've been calling it push-ups or pull-ups this entire time. But pull-ups is when you do the bar yoke, okay? right? Um, but anyway, here, here's like the list. I don't know if you'll be able to see that. Uh, let me just try and move it closer. Uh, all I see is the reflection on the screen, so I can't tell. But pretty much, it's just a list of everything. Currently, I have it marked out to day 20, and today is day 19 of exercising in a row. I've not missed a day. I almost missed a day yesterday, but I still did it anyway. And there's some afternoons as well where I'll just be like, ah, screw it, I'm bored, let's do another 8, you know? Hopefully, I'll move to 9 soon, because like, there was one video I did, or a few videos back on uh, Joe Smith Flyer, where I did push-ups, but I did a lot more than now, so I think that just shows how much heavier I've gotten. And how much weaker I've gotten as well. Like, when I talked about uh, me over-exercising, my left arm or shoulder hurt the most. 
And like, you know why, right? He's all right, you know, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're not gonna go too much more into detail about that. But on that, I've also been looking at my food. I, I left that one over there because it's not much, like it's kind of just personal stuff. You don't really need to know what I eat. But, you know, trying to not necessarily go straight into healthy because that's like a problem people do when they start exercising or they want to change their diet. They're like, right, stop everything I'm eating right now and replace it with this that I've never had before. You're meant to do it slowly and nicely and you phase it in slow as well so like for example um what do you call it uh buh, 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 buh. actually i can't think of any on top of my head but pretty much just trust me just trust me on that i i still have a bit of sweets so that's a bit of a problem but other than that like you know i want to just change uh like at one point it was more like me wanting to change for the better and now it's just me wanting to just change food to spice up my life you know it's kind of boring here in this box actually can this open Eh, it's alright, it's, it's not that bad. Hopefully that... I love the way the noises start just when I open the window, but it won't be that bad anyway. You need some background noise anyway. Actually, no, I just realized I'll be heard outside if I do that. Um, other than that, I guess like I've tried to start writing with my left hand. Again, left it over there. It's not much to see. It's really wobbly. Like, A, I'll try and draw on screen now. It's like be like that but to be fair if I wanted to I could keep going at it it'd be pretty good you know um other than that um my neighbor just saw me in the window there <laughs> um but yeah you know they, they're probably just saying to themselves yeah he, he's lost his mind um other than that drawing yeah that's the other one I wanted to mention so when it comes to drawing um, I, do I, yeah, I can show it, yeah, uh, okay, right, I don't know if you can see that, but pretty much I'm, I'm drawing a picture, and I wanted to draw a female instead, because I'm always drawing Joe Snipe Flyer, and this was meant to be a female version of Joe Snipe Flyer, but the thing is, like, I'm not going to get better at drawing if I just draw the one, and I kind of want to get better at drawing characters, so I decided to go for like the kind of swimsuit bikini kind of look first. So it's like less detail to draw in. So if I went in and drew myself like a trench coat and a mad hat and detail in the face and stuff, you know, there's no point. So I have to start somewhere like nice and simple. The only thing I'll never get over is where I drew the boobies. <laughs> I drew them way too low and I, I didn't want to, I don't know, even if I move them up, they'd still look a bit big. I wasn't aiming for that, alright, I swear. Like, I even have it written at the top. No, I'm not drawing porn. I'm trying to draw girls too, because equality. But, uh, yeah, right now, I've kind of... Right now, I've lost my touch for gaming. I haven't really been enjoying too much games. Only, I, yeah, I only really enjoy playing games when I'm playing with people nowadays. Uh, quarantine has actually also forced me to make a lot more videos, which I'm kind of good. Or, I, I like that a lot, because... The more videos I make, the better I feel, you know? It's actually something good. Of course, if Simon works there, I would do that either or. And there's one last thing. Oh, the lore of Janiki. Now, that's the biggest thing, in my opinion, that's happened this quarantine so far. Is being able to actually work in that. I don't know if it's out by now by the time this goes out or if it's going to come out at some point, but man. And originally, I was going to be like, alright, it's just going to be like one video, just an audio video of me talking. And then I'll release the actual script document joke onto Twitter and Reddit. And now it's just like, huh, we'll make an intro video to it. So before you read, we'll make the actual joke itself. And then we'll make another version, which I won't say what that other version is. It'll come out like, all, all three of them will come out one after another. I'll just say that much. Uh, but yeah, I think that's all I have to talk about for now. Um, I didn't think I'd talk for this long, to be honest, but... I'm going to just stop now before it becomes too long. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, obviously like it. Dislike if you didn't like it. Comment your thoughts and what you're doing during quarantine yourself. It would be pretty fun to see like what you guys are picking up. I, I might steal your ideas of what you're doing, but ignore that. Uh, subscribe and hit the bell if you do so desire. And I thank you guys for watching.